In video one we covered, is asphalt maintenance the right career for you? We went over whether you're wanting to door knock, whether or not you have the dedication to actually build your very own business. Are you willing to do what it takes to truly achieve success with your business? Step two, we spoke about whether or not this business will work in your area. We spoke about all the different pavement assets, residential driveways, commercial parking lots, taking a look in your neighborhood to see the opportunity. Doing some competitive analysis to determine whether your competitors are professional in your neighborhood and is there a true opportunity for you to beat them to winning every job that's out there. We then spoke about how do you get started in the business. We went over the steps to get started with the business, some of the different services that you can provide, and ultimately taking the next step, which is taking the leap and getting the right equipment in order to build your very own successful asphalt maintenance business. You see, there's different levels of service that you provide for asphalt maintenance. You've got surface preparation, one. You've got crack repair, two. You've got seal coating, three. You've got line striping, four. Surface preparation, making sure the cracks are all free of all dirt and debris so that your cracks are sealed properly. Also making sure that the complete surface is cleaned from all dirt and debris so that when you go to do your seal coating, it bonds properly for years to come. Step four, line striping. You wanna make sure to put down crisp lines on that surface to make sure that traffic is flowing properly and that people know where to park properly. Also, lines that are painted freshly on seal coated surfaces look absolutely beautiful and those are gonna be your before and after shots that you use for your sales as you're closing more deals. See, when you're first going out in the business, what you wanna do is you wanna make sure that you're getting the right equipment for each one of those services, right? Surface prep, crack sealing, seal coating, and line striping. Surface preparation. We have what's called a gas-powered blower. Gas-powered blower, very powerful. It literally forces out 180 mile an hour winds, blowing off all the dirt and debris off that surface, prepping it for that seal coat. Next, you'll want a crack cleaning machine. The crack cleaning machine is a gas-powered crack cleaner. You push it along just like a lawnmower. It's got an eight inch wire wheel. And what it does is it actually routes out that crack cleaning it from all dirt, debris, and vegetation, ensuring that when you lay down your rubber crack sealer, it bonds to the sidewalls, creating a watertight seal, preventing water from getting in, eroding the foundation of the asphalt where it can't bear its own weight, creating potholes and depressions that are safety issues and a fast track to deterioration of any pavement asset. So make sure your surface is clean, your cracks are clean. Step two, crack sealing. You wanna have a crack sealing machine. We have the RY10 base model, RY10 Pro, and RY10 Elite, all fantastic units. Those units are two in one. They will allow you to melt down the rubber cubes of crack sealer inside of their kettle, and then you'll apply that crack sealer in the cleaned out cracks at walking speed. You'll charge roughly a dollar a linear foot. Your cost is only roughly 14 cents a linear foot. Imagine the margin, right? So make sure you have your crack sealing machines. Once you start to grow your business, you're gonna reinvest your earnings into bigger units that will allow you to be even more efficient and productive. Like the RY30 Pro stationary kettle melts down 30 gallons of crack sealer. But this is all a reinvestment opportunity here, folks. You see, what we do is we get you started on the right foot where you are right now, and we scale your business to a business level like Alex Lucic, like we spoke about in video number one, who's built a $3 million company in six short years. But it starts somewhere and we get there eventually. That's what we're committed to doing with you. Seal coating is the next step. Now there's a variety of different options you can select for seal coating. We have units that you can get started for just around $1,250 up to units that cost $15,000. You ask, what's the difference, right? Difference is this, one unit is designed to plug into drums of sealer, spray directly from the drums onto the asphalt surface. It's only 55 gallons in a drum. So if you have a parking lot that let's say needs four drums, you're having to transfer from one drum to the next. That's very time consuming. That's not really maximizing your business to the full potential. Whereas a unit like we have, like the AK230 Pro, that's almost fitting four drums in one tank, meaning you don't have to travel back and forth for drum pickups. You have your seal rig right there on site. Your tank is big enough to put company branding on so that you ultimately look professional when you're showing up to jobs.
So if you have the money to invest into a professional seal coat sprayer, that's definitely what you want to do out of the gate. If not, no problem. Start with one of our budget-oriented spray systems and work your way up. But remember, reinvesting into your business means growth and momentum towards your ultimate goal. Again, the goal is to make sure that you're reinvesting into your business, adding to your business constantly, not just getting something and being comfortable with it, but moving towards a goal if you're truly wanting to achieve that goal. If you do want to stay still and you're happy with what you're doing, by all means do that. But if you're wanting growth, that's what we're committed to doing with you and we have the equipment to be able to provide you with to achieve that growth. Now, let's talk a little bit about leads, right? You need leads in order to convert them into customers and then renewable customers. So where do we get leads? First off, Facebook is a fantastic platform to put some Facebook ads out and really target your local area along with the demographic that you're truly wanting to target. Let's say that you're wanting to target facility managers, property managers of commercial complexes in your neighborhood. You can actually do that with a Facebook ad. As simple as putting together a video just like I'm presenting to you right now that could be a 20 second video of you saying something along the lines of, hi, I'm Judd from Imperial Asphalt Maintenance and I'd love the opportunity to protect your pavement assets at your parking lot. I'd love to clean out the cracks, seal those cracks up watertight, preventing any potholes and depressions. We'd then like to seal coat it with a commercial grade sealer that protects it from the environment for years to come. Let's extend your asphalt three times versus not maintaining it, which means it's on fast track to replacement and very costly for you. Call us at Imperial Asphalt, blah, 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 right? These are the kind of videos that you can shoot, put on Facebook as ads, in addition, you can also go on LinkedIn. LinkedIn's a fantastic platform to be able to go and scope out and look for people who are facility managers or essentially your prospect audience that you're looking to build. In sales, it's pretty simple. You have different layers. You've got prospecting, people you know, family, friends, friends that you may have not talked to for the last year, but you look in your phone book on your phone and you actually go through your contact list and you start dialing. Maybe somebody owns a gas station. Maybe somebody owns an estate driveway, parking lot. Reach out to the people you know, first stage of prospecting. Second layer of prospecting is people that your people know. Ask the people that you know on social media and on your contact list if they know anybody that could benefit from asphalt maintenance services to protect their pavement assets. Now, the third layer is cold calling. Cold calling is usually the most challenging. Now on Facebook ads, like I just referred to, you're not really having to do the cold calling. Facebook ads do that for you, targeting that demographic that fill the top of your funnel, which means that you get more leads that you can convert into customers. Once you go from prospecting, you generate your leads. Your leads then go to customers. You have customers. You're gonna nurture those customers, ask for referrals. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna send them a thank you card for the business, handwritten, or reaching out through social media and private messaging them, really thanking them for the business. That gives you that repeat business so that every two years, you can go out and get that renewable business without having to work too hard for it. You see, I'm standing on a parking lot right here, 220,000 square feet. I did this a couple of years ago, did it again, and that's repeat business. Who do they call when they think asphalt maintenance? Me, and guess what? That's literally a project that is a tremendously healthy margin project that allows me to continuously win. I know you wanna to win too, and we can help you achieve that. So now that we know where we get our leads, Facebook, LinkedIn, and reaching out to people you know, people that you people know, let's make sure that we stick to the grind here. This is the best piece of advice that I have for you. You see, when I first started in the business, I literally had no clue what I was doing. And now I'm standing here, speaking about building your very own dream. I had a dream, and my dream was to be able to provide my family with the financial means to create freedom for our family. And it took time, it took grind, it took hustle, but I didn't stop. Just like I'm doing right now in this video, I'm trying to give you the pieces that I know and I am confident that I can deliver to you to help you build your very own successful asphalt maintenance company. My last piece of advice to you is this. It's called grind and hustle. You see, when I first started, I didn't know a thing about what I was doing. But I had somebody that took me under their wing and brought me door to door and taught me how to do things right. We can do this in this virtual world that we live in right now and we're committed at Asphalt Kingdom to providing you exactly what you need to build your own thriving asphalt maintenance company. 
and we do it step by step in palatable size pieces. So my best advice here, stick to the grind, stick to the hustle. Once you have that momentum, surf the wave and let us be behind you and on your shoulder, your pavement guru on your shoulder, helping you build your very own successful asphalt maintenance business.